I ain't gonna lie. I remember when Young Thug put out that album and it was featuring Drake and a few cats. And it was some it was some sneak sneak disses for the gunner on that shit. Now, mm-hmm. gr- granted, that was a very long time ago, probably over a year ago. So I don't know if the relationship has changed since then. But you're right. When Thugger gets home, we'll kind of see how everybody uh, is and yeah, uh, the mostly. temperament. Wow. Yeah. So like gonna when people really thought it was over for him and you know it was a little bit dramatic but like i'm really still stuck on like oh my god he really did do a lot of diverse features yes yo honestly if if Lil baby does that it like might work like he really might be back on top because look at what happened to gunna so he dodged the allegations he dodged the allegations i like that fuck it can't beat him join him (laughs) (laughs) and i like Lil baby so i'm I'm wishing him the best i I hope he pulls it off me as well i mean i love a good comeback yeah, that's a fact. That's a fact. That's a fact. Um, are there some people that you just know or think can't come back? Oh, uh, like it's over for them. Like it's just over. Uh, Danny Lay. What? Yeah. You think so? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Do you I not think so? I don't. Uh, I don't. I don't. As know. long as I got breath. She's gonna get oh, she's gonna, she gonna, she gonna get supported. What's nah, your favorite nah, song? Nah, listen, nah, this is the one with Chris Brown. What's your favorite song? Nah, no, name Chris... three. Name, name three. Danny Lay songs. The one with Chris Brown. <laughs> name three. No, name four. Danny Lay songs. Four, three, four. All right. Um, easy. Right. Okay. Really easy. Easy. That was the Chris Brown one. All right. The version without Chris Brown. Give me a hard so one. Stop easy. it. Now nah, give me a hard one. Nah, that's easy to remix. And give easy me the regular. One. Give me a hard one. Now. And then um, you know the other shit. <laughs> she got shit. Exactly. Craving. Yeah, this is the time. She got situated. You don't know that one. It's the time to help you. Yeah. Right? Nah. Yeah. Nah. But yeah, I think her career gonna be just fine. <laughs> How is doing no music? As long as I got breath. You don't know no music. You ain't been to none of her shows, nah. but she's gonna be just. You fine. think she's beautiful? Nah, she been fighting demons. Yeah. yeah. Oh my she goodness. Been fighting she got dead to me. She yeah. got Hennessy, heartbreaker. She got cat. All that. You're y- looking it up right y'all now. Y'all remember that? Nah, I remember that. That was the latest album, 2022. I'm kidding. I'm, I know. I'm not like wishing for a downfall, but I mean no, that no, just no. came to mind. I don't know. I feel like she hasn't navigated. Uh, there were a lot of things working against her at oh, for once, sure. yeah. especially like the the baby relationship, like a lot yeah. of things that like she just was going through. Right. It's not like I'm rooting for her to fail, mm-hmm. but it's like I just I don't know. Like it wasn't played out like really well, and mm. I don't know. It's, it's been question. a few years since then, so if she does another like good feature, mm-hmm. I can think she. I think she's gonna come back. She's gonna okay. Come back. It's all fucking. I me hope up, so. Man. I mean, I hope so. I want like I wish the best for anybody. So and too, she seems like she's uh, just being more focused as a mom at the moment mm-hmm. but you know she has been out and about and doing things so mm-hmm. i'm gonna throw a name out there and to reggie's point i don't see nobody do bad if anything i love these people and i came up on these people but like reggie was implying i'm noticing something i'm seeing how these people are being received now mm. even with however i revere them like i'm just seeing how they... anyway big sean <gasps> take that back it's my dog <laughs> I love Big Sean so Yo, much. Yo, Big Sean dropped a whole rebuttal to the big three. <laughs> Did he? <laughs> Wait, yes. Nah, yes. Wow. Recently? While they were, yes. were being No, no, I remember like people yes. were making fun of him like, yo, your timing is yeah. just always remember, off. Like, his, no, he didn't. Yes. Had the, he had the abs. Remember that? So now you I see. I remember his abs. So now you see what I've never seen. Though. It was the album. It was the. <laughs> That's that's what he used to lead the whole thing, but it didn't work. <laughs> like, he, he had the shirt off and shit. He had some words. He referenced the big, this. yeah. He referenced the big three on that song. That's what I was saying with Pusha T, right? Like, it's just, it's just certain, it's just certain, Alex. it's just certain. Hold on, hold on. It's just certain people who, who are gonna, and you know, insert themselves in the thing. And people won't care as much. <laughs> that's all I was saying. They was just, and that's my guy. Yeah. That would have been the prime time for Kendrick and Drake to get at him. But, I, Drake said it was a 20 v one and then named Sean. <laughs> what does Sean say to, about Drake? You gotta play. It's called precision. I think you gotta hear it. You was he hear it. was he going at mm-hmm. them or was he more just bigging up himself? He referenced it, but okay, 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 okay. but Drake and J Cole bigged up themselves on first person shooter. Yeah, and okay. Kendrick ain't like that. Okay. Pew, pew. Pew, pew. Hey, he's shooting too. Look, it's guns out. <laughs> Nobody getting hit. <laughs> Shots just that fly. was a good joke. That was a good joke. Wait. <laughs> I want to appreciate that. Pew, pew. The song called, <laughs> song called Precision. Not a bullet landed. Hey, 
Damn, I don't know where it's at. It's in there, though. Oh, it's somewhere. It's somewhere. In there. <laughs> Wait, I just want to repeat Wait, what Alex I mean, said. Yeah. You know how, like, Big Sean was like, pew, pew, pew. Like, he was shooting, and then he was like, oh, you're shooting. But nobody getting hit. <laughs> I just really appreciated that. He was just sending shots. Nobody got hit. Nobody ducked for he was cover. Like, Look, I'm shooting, y'all. Nobody ducked for cover. You call that nigga Will Bro, Smith. <laughs> this is. Mike <laughs> Lowry. Yeah, no shots. This is the same Big Sean. That made control with Kendrick Lamar. Oh like my this is we, we knew we knew Big Sean to be involved in the We don't. That's my don't, point. Oh, so we now don't. I hate when we people don't. rewrite <laughs> rewrite history in terms of Big uh -oh. Sean. We got no. I don't like it. No, I, I fuck with Big Sean, but like there's almost nothing he could have done to make himself relevant in this arena. That, yeah, I guess that's why. That's I was what I'm up. saying. Yeah. It was the timing too. Like trying to compare Big Show and the Pusha T in this particular arena, Moving I don't think post. it applies. I think it was a phenomenal joke by you. Kudos. <laughs> I, see, I see what you did there. It was a great shot. You, you landed. You actually slam dunked that bitch in. My man. So shout out to you, but I don't think it applies. Who got a no, bigger fan wait, base? Wait, what? what? <laughs> oh show. my gosh. Who got a bigger fan I'm base? I'm triggered. Wait, Big wait, show wait, hold Pusha on. T. wait, wait, wait. It's closer than you think. I know. I want you to answer. Wait, I don't I'm know. asking why. What are you saying doesn't land? Because he, you asked like, oh, whose career like won't come back? And he said Big Sean. Are you saying that didn't land? No, I was saying no, no. That that's if oh, that's, oh, his, okay, that's okay, okay. if that's what he thinks, yeah. then mm -hmm. that's what he thinks. I'm right. saying the comparison, like, oh, mm -hmm. his shot at Drake and the guys <laughs> didn't land just like Pusha T's uh -huh. wouldn't land. I'm just, but oh. it's very different because there's history with Pusha T. Why I think that's gonna put a magnifying glass on anything that he has to say about Drake compared to Big Sean. Push that's all I'm saying. Push that's all I'm saying, and I'm leaving it right there. Push T got a bigger fan base than Rick Ross. Pierre. Yeah. <laughs> How do we shut this down? Does Push T, <laughs> Push T got a bigger fan base than Rick so Ross? The boys are fighting. So this is, so this is, so is, Push T got a bigger fan base than Rick Ross. I would say yeah. Pierre. <laughs> How do we deal so, with this PM? So, so sum this all up. I learned in therapy. Everybody, I love oh, therapy. everybody, male and female, we listen through different filters. <laughs> this is true. So you could be saying <laughs> something, uh huh, and understanding and, it differently, right? Okay. So that's what's going on here. But uh, I oh, think at God. some point they'll understand so each other. He's so, an ultimate gaslighter, <laughs> and I love this. I'm God. so glad. I'm so glad. Big Sean, Rick uh -huh. Ross, they got none, me. none of them have the history. But as the Pusha T and Drake thing, I think that, that I think that variable is what gives him Rick the Ross, magnifying glass. Rick Ross had immense history, yeah. not with Drake. Yeah, as being friends, not For as now. not as being rivals. And he took it, to, but not there. as being rivals. But, but he took it to he the, didn't reveal that I, he had a fucking child. Can I tell Do you, you understand what kind of card that is? Rick that Ross, that is a big joke in all of this. So nobody that you name has anything like that in a talk for Pusha like Pusha T had. Nobody. You can name the biggest rapper you want right now. It's not going to change how I feel, bro. That history that they have is is different. So you keep thinking Rick Ross, and you keep thinking <laughs> fucking Pusha T and Metro Boomin, all these other niggas that you want to name, it don't matter because Push did what Push did, nigga. Like, you know what he do. <laughs> <laughs> so, Rick Ross, right? <laughs> Oh my God. Rick Ross, right? I'm not doing this with you. you Let's no. talk some hee hee <laughs> jokes, bro. We got oh, a whole yeah. comedy list. I'm just saying. I'm just I saying. I want to know what makes you laugh. I'm just That's saying. Rick Ross put like, out champagne moments. I just want, and he took it to the point where they was rivals. That's what that was with the exam. I waited. I let you cook. There's no history, and nobody cared. <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm just saying. He put out a whole diss track, and nobody cared. Why? Oh, because wow. there was other uh, shit going on. Mm -hmm. the, the heavyweight was out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, exactly. cool. Wouldn't you consider Pusha exactly. T a heavyweight? Yeah. Wouldn't you consider Rick Ross a heavyweight? Not in this arena, no. Rick Ross and Pusha T are not in the same class when it comes to rap? I don't think <laughs> in conjunction with dissing Drake, uh, it does not matter. I bet. Because of the history of Pusha T revealing that he had a fucking child and made but him what tap if, out of a beef. But what about the history? That, but, that history alone, that point this. alone disqualifies any other newcomers in this beef mm. that isn't Kendrick Lamar or J. Cole. But history is history, right? Anybody outside of that, it doesn't matter. Kanye West. <laughs> but Kanye, let's talk about Kanye. Let's, let, let's take your point because right. you want to stick on this fan base shit, right? No, 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 no. So I'm just saying, I'm just, Kanye like, West. I'm just no, saying no, history. I heard enough. I'm just saying history. You. But no, 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 I'm answering directly to what you're <laughs> saying and you're not answering me. I'm just answering what you're saying. History is history, correct? Correct. Okay, so Pusha T's history with Drake yeah. was some tumultuous shit, right? Drake's history with Rick Ross was with somebody that he's really close with and made great music with, right? Mm-hmm. There's an argument to be made on both sides that they both had history with each other, and then Rick Ross took it to beef. You didn't listen to what I just said. Mm -hmm. I, because I acknowledge that. What I'm saying yeah. is yeah. 
the history is different. Pusha T revealing that he had a child yeah. is very different than them being friends and then not being friends for whatever the reason may be. Right. It's very different. But some would say, you know, my friend just switched up on me. That's deep. It's I'm not, just saying it's, it's different not across bigger, the board. It's not bigger than the person revealing that the biggest rapper in the world had a child before he was able to. God, that I'm with card you. alone is I'm something that trumps all. I'm with it, you. That's what I'm trying to say. I'm not denying the history, but Kanye West. Kanye West has one of the biggest magnifying glasses on him in hip hop and rap. He has tried to insert himself so many mm -hmm. times in his Drake shit, yeah, so many it. different ways, and nobody gives a fuck. And that is Kanye West. But doesn't he have history with Drake and they got He beef? does. But I'm saying the one thing that is the Pusha kid, T is the, has, I know what you're saying is the kid thing. I know. I and not that. just the kid thing, but they, he tapped out of the rap beef. After Pusha T dropped the diss song, We've never heard him acknowledge Pusha T again. The one time we thought he acknowledged Pusha T was Mob Ties. And we didn't even, he didn't even write the shit, apparently. Damn. Yeah. So that's what I'm saying. You keep trying to couple Pusha T with all these other guys and all these because other rappers. Because they're but similar. He, but they're I, not, they're similar in what? In the album sales? They're similar in what? Sales, their career, popularity, they're, they're impact. Not similar. They're not similar because he's the one person that's got a one-up on Drake I've given outside that. of Kendrick Lamar. I've given that to you. So he's in rare air when it comes to this arena. So when you keep mentioning Big Sean and when you keep mentioning all these other people, it, it doesn't matter. It, it doesn't equate to the to same you. thing. To nobody. No, that's no, no, no. invested in this no, shit. No, 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 to you, because I saw people go, yo, why the fuck is Rick Rose beefing with Drake? They have so much history. Yo, what the, f like, we've seen that, but to you, I understand it. Like, you're right. To you, I have, I can't negate anything you just said. I can't negate nothing you just said. To you. But to other people, they're going to put, push to you. Yeah, well, to me, yeah. Well, right, so well, me and to you. Well, yeah, to so other people, people on us. To me, I'm going to group niggas like Rick Ross and Pusha T together. Especially when they've done music together, like they would assume that they're also in the same uh, like air, right? If they're doing music together, if it's when they both say that they're both in the same air, that's all I'm saying. I know the kid. I know I get it. I'm just saying sometimes when people say things, it's the messenger. Great pod today, man. Y'all niggas, <laughs> yo, y'all look, look great, man. Yeah, wow, wow. We go. <laughs> Leave it on the couch. He's like, great. He was like, great. Like, yeah, yeah, like, yeah, 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 yeah,